Innovation Award is about creating new ideas uh, for, for the things that humanity needs, in this case the medical needs that, that society has. Robotics in the medical field is very powerful because it allows us to extend the surgeon's or the clinician's reach within the patient or within the workspace and it also allows us to develop new procedures that otherwise we'd only be able to do with maybe our shoulder, our elbow, our wrist and our hand. So it's multifactorial in its use, but it really has some headwinds against it because it is such a new technology and the governing agencies are having challenges with it, but the innovators like KUKA are really pushing that forward. A strong KUKA team is supporting the finalists. Yeah. They get technical education, how to use our technology. We provide them with a robotic system for the time to develop their application. We support them with, uh, during the time with technical problems um, and getting the, the system, uh, system running. To prepare it here for the, for the Medica, to offer them a stage so that they can present their ideas to other researchers, to investors, to the media, to make it uh, public what these uh, ideas are about. Out of these five finalists, um, an international jury selects the, the winner and the winner will be donated with uh, 20,000 euros. Robotics is not only cool, but it actually can do things, right? So you can use the, the, the power of computer technology, which everybody now witness you know, in their mobile phones, but giving a body to it. So you embody this power that you have in computations in something that can move and do actions on the physical world. Robotics is becoming more important because what it allows us to do is rapidly accelerate skill sets. So historically, when you're a surgeon, perhaps, or even any kind of clinician, it takes years to get certain movements down and years to get certain sort of tactics down uh, at a patient level. What a robot can do, it can accelerate that quickly because it can learn from what people have done before, incorporate that into an AI or a machine learning application, and then live that through a robotic platform. The finalists um, have been given um, uh, the Elvia Med free of charge from the uh, beginning of the year to the Medica. The Elvia Med is a dedicated robotic system. It's a so-called collaborative robot that works closely to a human, to a medical doctor, to a patient, to a therapist. The Elvia Med is specified for the use in the medical environment. We have pre-certified um, as a robotic component to be integrated into a medical device. And the big problems in medical fields, I mean, the, the big killers of our age are, of course, uh, in the field of oncology and cardiovascular diseases. But there are many other uh, applications which are not as killers, but very relevant. For example, the winner of, of, uh, of the award this year uh, has to do with rheumatology, you know, uh, aging is a problem that everybody has to deal with. So we saw five teams with amazing ideas and demonstrations, so it was uh, very difficult uh, to decide. But after careful discussion of all teams, we found a clear winner team. I think today's winner could make the world a better place because it addresses a number of things. The focus was a solution to rheumatoid arthritis and the diagnostic on it. So with the changing centers of care, where we're taking health out of the hospital and putting them to smaller facilities around neighborhoods, that product, the Arthur, can go right into these walk-in, walk-out clinics and address the shortage of clinicians in the diagnostic side and be able to titrate the medicine better because you have a better diagnostic, in addition to building an enormous data set on that therapeutic need. The team presented a very complete solution, uh, making use of the robot's features, which is uh, well designed, ready to the market, and it will have a great impact on the treatment of this disease. I think it's a huge achievement. It's very big, big for us, and it's a huge opportunity to be here at Midican and present our wonderful device, and also to get the recognition from those um, real professional judges. They give about six to eight months time, you know, where you can propose an idea and they give you the complete hardware kit, you know, which is one of the best robots in the world, I would say. So we're looking to, to consolidate and see uh, how to uh, uh, approach 
the further product uh, development from here. It's a great way to speed up development of your product. So we started half a year ago with just a cuff, an end effector, and then uh, six months, yeah, we, we came to a finished product uh, thanks to the KUKA Innovation Award. So the in Innovation Award means a, a great deal for our work. It's going to help us accelerate our path to getting legal to market and really help us uh, move the innovation and the technology forward. KUKA was very supportive uh, from the beginning on. It started with a one-week training, which was very helpful uh, to, to get off the, the ground. Uh, and then over the course of, of those months, uh, the support was, was uh, tremendous. So uh, besides the, the hardware and the software we get, uh, there is also the personal component and uh, a lot of support. Industrial Intelligence.